All right, so this is my first vlog entry, my vlog that I've got going on. Um, one of the things I wanted to talk about was the importance of family. Now, some of you are saying, no, yeah, yeah I, I live with my family. If you're younger, yeah, absolutely. I live with my family. They're there. They're, uh, they're you know, we have Christmas. We, they celebrate birthdays with me, but this is a little bit different. Um, me, yes, I totally had the ex exact same experience throughout my entire life, but I don't have that now. Now, it's not because they've died, but it's because they've moved away right um, I always grew up living in Ontario Burlington Ontario Canada there we go and now I'm currently living in Hamilton Ontario Canada uh, just a little bit of fun facts for all you guys I've always been open and honest with you all so why not put that out there um, my youngest sister still lives in Canada. I'm not gonna put out where she lives. Um, and then, I, I, I have three sisters, by the way. I have three. Uh, one that's younger than me, uh, two that are younger than me, my God, wow. And one that's older than me. Um, so the second youngest is in Costa Rica. My oldest sister is in Costa Rica, and my parents have moved to Costa Rica. Um, it's been really hard. Uh, not the easiest thing ever, but at the end of the day, what you learn to appreciate is family and the time that you've spent with them. Um, every day... I go through kind of this uh, kind of mental thing, I guess, where it's like I wake up and sure I'm waking up and you have to work and stuff. You have to work to make money, to live and all that great stuff. But I think about that, of course, and then I think about like. What, what what what's my family doing today? What are they gonna be doing? What what like what are they going through? And it's especially hard to talk to my family in Costa Rica because like right now their internet isn't so great. And it's not like I'm gonna call them every day because of long distance charges and all that stuff. Um so uh, the, the cheapest way to get in contact with them and the the most somewhat easier way to get in contact with them is through the internet through Facebook chat or Skype um, and I say easy with uh, you know quotations because it's not easy they uh, at the moment they're living off of satellite internet which or, or, or 3G which is not the most reliable out there because if there's a goddamn cloud in the sky there goes the internet done cut uh so you have to pray for like a, a non-cloudy day and hope for the best if you get a 25 to 30 minute conversation that's amazing that is amazing to get with somebody that lives out there but with them moving into this new house uh apparently they're getting um some kind of new internet so I'm very excited about that. We'll be able to video chat through Skype, hopefully, fingers crossed. Uh, if not that, then at least we'll be able to have somewhat of a stable call um, with, vi uh, with audio, right? Like audio Skype calls and stuff like that. But at the end of the day, what I'm really trying to say here is never take your family for granted because you never know what's going to happen, right? Um, I was a real shithead when I was younger. <laughs> like, I was a real dumbass. And I put my family through a lot of shit. 
I put my sisters through a lot of shit. And, uh, with teasing them and stuff like that. But as you grow into an adult and you mature, uh, you realize that they are the most important people in your life. Your family. Not only your family, but your friends. Your friends that you grow up with. Um, and let's be honest, you're not, you go through high school, you go through grade school. You're, those friends are going to switch and change and they're not always going to be around. But the ones that are around are the most important. Friends wise is what I'm talking about. I know I was talking about family, but I'm going out of friends now. Uh, family and friends are the most important people that you'll have in your entire life. The ones that back you up through thick and thin. Uh, but yeah, that's all I wanted to say. I, you know, um, if you enjoy this kind of vlog series with me just talking about my life or my opinions on things, then uh, give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments down below. Uh, originally, I didn't know if I was going to make this just like a Facebook group exclusive or something like that I, I think it should just be posted out to everyone why the fuck not uh, I think the next thing I'm gonna do is a reaction video to um, old twitch streams that I used to do back in 2009 through 2011 um, and see how that goes I don't know I'm thinking about things thinking about things it, it, Again, if you want to hear me talk about something or my opinion or you want to hear about my life, a Q&A or something like that, let me know in the comments down below. And uh, we'll get to it later on. Of course, as always, I'm Dave McCauley. I hope you have a great day and I'll talk to you guys later. I, I don't even know. I don't even know.